Christmas celebrations are happening everywhere. Our nation's capital, the mall, our schools, our homes, even at work. Unfortunately, we sometimes forget where the celebration began, and more importantly, why we are celebrating. This morning, our Studio 7 cast is about to discover how easy it is to forget why we are celebrating. Please join us as they present Who Stole Christmas. This is going to be the best Christmas ever. Yeah, I hope Santa Claus got my list early. He better. I have an iPod and an iPhone on my list. Tommy, help me get to that bottom for me. I'm changing my list to the new year. Xbox, a touchscreen LG cookie, and a Toshiba satellite stand-of-the-art laptop are just a few of the things I'm expecting this year. What about you, Sam? I just need a car. You're only 10. What you going to do with the car? I'll have my license in six years. Be realistic. Santa Claus isn't going to be a 10, isn't going to book a 10 year old a car. But I've been good. I've tried to brush my teeth and take a bath at least once a day. I helped my mom with chores once a week. And I helped an old lady cross the street at two. Wow. You guys are always making fun of me. That's because your head is stuck in the clouds. We'll see who gets the last laugh this Christmas. Okay, <laughs> which one of you kids is going to help me put up these decorations? Which one of you kids is going to help me put up these decorations for a fee? Don't go and raise $10 to one. $10 for one hour? Take it or leave it, Dad. You guys drive a hard bargain, but since I can't do this myself, we have a deal. And Dad, you promised to put the stocking set last night. Santa's coming in three days. Yeah, doesn't that mean I have three days to do it? Dad, you procrastinate too much. <laughs> Sounds like something your mother would say. <laughs> she is. Have you seen these lists? Yes, I have. This is ridiculous. <laughs> When did Christmas become about getting, getting, getting? But they'll be devastated if they wake up on Christmas morning and they don't have what they wanted. I don't even know what an iPod is. Let alone, wow. the prices on these items are outrageous. What are we supposed to say? I don't know when these kids thought Christmas was just about getting expensive gifts. Our list were never this long. Our kids are born in a new generation. It's not the 1980s anymore. <laughs>
the day before Christmas Eve. There are no stockings and there are no gifts. But Christmas is ruined. Why, Dad? <laughs> Christmas.